Hey guys, thanks so much for coming to my page. This look I call my teddy bear brown look because of the brown of course with a touch of glamour in the corners. If you guys are interested in learning how I did this look, keep watching. Thanks. So I'll start by applying this color saddle all over my lids and it's by MAC Cosmetics. For the crease, I'm using a fluffy brush to apply a deeper shade of brown. This one is called Swiss Chocolate by MAC Cosmetics. I'm going to use that same Swiss Chocolate to go underneath my eye, but this time I'm going to use a angled, more defined brush to do that. For the glamour, I'll be using Dollhouse Cosmetics. Um, gold is actually a highlighter by the name of Pixie Dust. And of course, come in there with the gel liner. And just a tiny wing. Well, a little bit thicker than usual, but not too much. Starting from the back and coming forward. I have this e.l.f. Cold Eyeliner, which I really love because um, it has the pencil tip. And then on the other end, it has like a little smudger. So it's great whenever I'm trying to do a smudgy um, eyeliner look for the bottom. So as you can see, after applying it, I've just kind of smudged it out with the bottom of that pencil and it makes a really good grungy look. Then I'm going to just sweep some of that Swiss chocolate on top of it and apply the lashes. So now we are finishing up my face. This is my NARS concealer in the color Ginger. And I'm going to blend that in with my faux beauty blender. This is actually um, like beauty cosmetics, something like that I got from a drugstore. Works amazingly. Five bucks. You just wet it, um, kind of squeeze out the excess water, and then get to work. And it blends wonderfully. So definitely. I'll give the name for you guys and put it underneath in my details. So check out for that. I'm using an angled brush and I'll be using blunt It's a color for MAC cosmetics it's actually a blush but it's such a deep color I use it as a very nice contour it works great and I start by applying a little bit and really just blend that out I don't want my contour to be too harsh against my skin so it's really good to blend it out a lot and I just kind of go on my cheekbones, um, down my jawline, above to kind of not emphasize my forehead, to kind of hide my forehead. <laughs> then I'll be using my bronzer with a very, very fluffy brush just to lightly blend that out, that contour out a little bit more. Then I'll go over my nose with that angled brush just to kind of contour that very gently. Now I'm using a blush by the name of Dusty Rose and I'm just lightly sweeping it over my cheeks. And my most favorite highlighter ever, Gold Deposit by MAC. Putting those in the core areas, nose and cheekbones. Now Milani has these really nice matte colors this one's in the color stunning it's a really nice nude tone i love it i love everything i know anything makeup is all i love it but i'm just gonna apply this all over and the good thing about this color is it's so nude and natural that i don't even need a liner with it so just apply it Seriously, guys, I'm like a lipstick fanatic, so I could just do this 
all day but i'm pretty much done like everything's done so <laughs> i hope you guys like it this is my teddy bear brown look please like and subscribe hey everybody this is sarah sarah say hey hey <laughs> see you my coffee zoom in to her join sorkin <laughs> so we do here multitask okay he's eating breakfast i'm doing my makeup and as of now i don't have anywhere to go Thank you.